For most people, life is all about family. But as an undercover cop, my life is all about a family of Armenian gangsters who might kill me at any moment. The main thing about Chris is that he's a total idiot. Just tell me what happened. Start at the beginning of the night. I got ready at home. I wore my other black top with a zip. It's very similar to the one I'm wearing right now. It's too far back. He's a policeman. He's undercover in an Armenian crime family who are all very shady and um, dangerous. Hi, this is Zoe. If it's urgent, you can get me on the other number. Nine, nine, nine. Zoe, I have to see you. I think they want me to kill somebody. Any type of social interaction in which he has to pitch at being either cool or impressive or accepted, he massively misfires and gets wrong. Not great traits for an undercover policeman. <laughs> the Sarkissian brief needs an undercover cop who thinks Armenian, acts Armenian, breathes Armenian. But I'm not Armenian. But you had a Greek uncle. Zoe is Chris's handler. She pretty much single-handedly represents the police and all the, the, the goodies. They want me to kill him. What the hell am I going to do? It's you or him, Chris. And I can't afford to lose another one, not after Henderson. The paperwork alone would be horrific. As the series unfolds, we realise that uh, there is possibly a little something going on between them. A slight free song or something, a little... A little twinkle here and there. <laughs> Arasarkissian. 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 Ara is a powerful, vulnerable patriarch, the small president of a crazy country, which is his family. The Sarkissians are Arasarkissian at the top. Lucinace's mother. Ara's brother is Arno Sarkissian. Garabed, Christoph, their minders. Below that, the nephews and nieces, Stepan and Lara Sarkissian. She's really cool, really tough, really together in herself. I think a little bit psychopathic, but in the, in the best possible way. <laughs> Chris is drawn to her in perhaps a way that he shouldn't be in the context of his job. Hello, Uncle Ara, or should I say, Khrajisht Muyakur Ara. That means goodbye, Auntie Ara. Who is Stepan? I certainly haven't got to the bottom of him yet, and I think it will take quite a, a definitely another series to excavate that. Definitely, if not three. So along comes Chris, who's not a Sarkissian, but is invited into the fold. He is very much out of his traffic policeman depth. Chris, there are some people I would like you to meet. I think you could be the beginning of a beautiful bastard. Thank you. If I had to sum up the show. It's a sitcom about gangsters. It's fun. It's fast and it's frenzied. It's one of the funniest scripts I've ever read. Sort of like The Sopranos, if The Sopranos was a sitcom. It has a little bit of silliness in it. It's a show about a guy trying not to get killed and trying to have sex. It's what I absolutely love doing. It's quick, pacey. It's stupidity played absolutely straight horrible, nasty, frightening criminal world. And in the middle of it is this little buffoon who really shouldn't be there. You can climb a 